Hi everybody. Um, my Julia is looking good. Windscreen's back in. Engine's back in. Drive lines all done. But I do have an issue. <laughs> um, I'm just doing this for posterity because I just want to keep a track of it. Uh, I did rings and bearings and new liners and uh, chains, uh, sprockets, you name it, I've done it all. The head was uh, done by a guy, headmaster down the road. I did a compression check on it before I put the carbies back on. I don't know why. One of them still needs overhauling. And number one cylinder is only 115 PSI. So I did a cylinder leak test and it's blowing out through the inlet. I'm going to show you, um, just for the record, I'll put my glasses on. Uh, piston number one, top dead center. Mark. The marks. There and there. Yeah, there, top dead center. On the firing cycle, of course. Clearance. Uh, where is it? Oh, I can't see if you can see that. That is... Point 0.5 of a mil. All right, there, there it goes there. So, valve, obviously, totally closed. Exhaust, totally closed. Inlet, totally closed. I think it, uh, the correct, uh, that's point 0.5 tight, and it's point 0.48. Um, right, so, if I put air down the cylinder, if I find my little compressor. I'm trying to do this with one hand. And I taped up the inlet. So, you saw that, obviously something very wrong. I'm going to pull the head off again before I get too carried away, but that's where we're up to. I'm sure you've seen the car all done. It's all ready. I'm, uh, yeah, I even lined the boot. Well, and the windscreen's in, they all need, to, all need a bit of a clean. The whole car's a bit messy in here, but anyway. Uh, that's all for for folks, for for folks, for for folks. Time to pull the head back off. Ugh! But it's easy. All right, bye. Ha <laughs> ha